Americans love entertainment. Movies, music, video games, the NBA, YouTube, Instagram. Um, we can't get enough of spending time at casinos or with fantasy football leagues, but the sad truth is we need to get rid of all of that because the fact of the matter is entertainment takes up so much of our time and money when we could be spending it on something better. Um, entertainment is, entertainment is a, a, an accommodation. It's, a, um, it's an extra thing that we get, and it's not paramount to all the, all the important things that are at hand in our world today. Um, entertainment is dangerous and distractor that is detrimental to the improvement of the world that, that the world so desperately needs. The Hollywood Reporter in 2018 said that we spent 52 billion hours watching NBC's The Office in, tw in 2018. Um, 52 billion hours is equivalent to 99,103 um, years just watching The Office in 2018. And 2.5 hours per day is spent on your phone for the average adult according to Vox. 2.5 hours per day is equivalent to 53 days out of the year we're just spending on our phones. And USA Today says that the average American household spends $2,913 per month on entertainment costs. And that is $34,956 per year on entertainment. And with 138 million households in the United States, that's over $3 billion spent per year just on entertainment. This is a lot of time and money that we spend. But why keep it when there are so many more important things at hand that we could be doing instead of enjoying entertainment? The U.S. Bureau of Labor Statistics says that from 2011 to 2015, only 6% of people volunteered per day, and they normally spend about two hours. And according to debt.org, the total debt of Americans is about $13.21 trillion, and that's usually from credit card or student loans. And the U.S. research market, and its net worth is about $47 billion per year. And in comparison, the media and entertainment market is $717 billion per year. Now imagine a world that instead of watching the Westminster Dog Show, everyone who was watching that decided to um, cook a meal that could be given to the homeless or people that are starving. And imagine instead of going to a movie and spending 10, maybe 20 bucks with popcorn, uh, you could eliminate your student debt by saving up. And imagine if all of the net worth, all of the money that goes into the entertainment industry was, was transferred into the research industry. That way we could come up with new solutions to climate change and solving diseases with way more easier with all the funding and research going into it. We are so addicted to entertainment and we need sobriety to finally realize how much it is holding us back from making real progress in the world, whether that progress be financial, humanitarian, scientific, or social. Now, maybe I'm proposing too much, because after all, we love our entertainment. How can we get rid of it? Maybe instead of getting rid of all of entertainment, maybe we just focus less on it, and we save a little bit of our resources of time and money. Instead of playing Minecraft, why don't we just clean up our house? And instead of going to a movie, we put that money into a savings account that could help us, um, that, that could give us emergency funds for a natural disaster or unexpected unemployment. Now, now, waiting, now by just using less of our time and resources on entertainment, we can help make real progress to ourselves and to others in the world. And as William Penn once said, time is what we want most, but what we use the worst. And we need to change that and reconsider how we use our time and our money so that we can make change in the world. Thank you.